So welcome to our YouTube channel, um, episode one. A um, couple of things we're gonna be talking about is, we're gonna be talking about how she told me she was pregnant. We're gonna be talking about what I think um, the gender is, what she thinks the gender is, and then boom, we'll give our uh, most natural um, emotion to what the sex is. <clears throat> so, chapter one. Chapter one, I have my thing. <laughs> So basically, what happened? What day was that? That was around what? What would you say? Well, not when I first thought. When I first thought about it. So what happened was for about three weeks, I have been um, feeling weird. So I have been feeling I don't know, just really sluggish. So. Um, I was feeling really sluggish, you know, when it was time for me to wake up in the morning and go to work. I felt like I didn't want to get out of bed. I felt like there was a ton of bricks kind of weighing me down. And this went on, like I said, for some time. Um, finally, I told my mom, you know, I had a dream but that I was pregnant. And um, it wasn't a good dream, but we're not going to get into that. Anyway, I had a dream that I was pregnant. And uh, it's my mom. We bought a pregnancy test. I took it. And... Um, I thought it said negative. So there was like a faint line, but I wasn't sure if it was a test line or actual positive. So uh, long story short, I Googled stuff and um, I decided to check it up as a negative and kind of move on. So fast forward to about a week and a half later, I kept feeling the same way. Um, when I was at work, you know, I was using my lunches to take naps, etc., etc. So I told myself, I said, you know what, today I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna take a pregnancy test. So I went to Walmart and I bought the one that says pregnant or not pregnant. Now usually, because I've taken like multiple pregnancy tests, but usually I just buy, you know, the plus, the negative. But this time, for some reason, I felt like I was pregnant. And I'm like, I wanna know for sure if it's positive or negative. I don't want, you know, I don't want any confusion. So I went and I bought the expensive one. And then I came home, I ran to the bathroom. And I was like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I was like so super nervous. Cause like, I've been wanting this for so long. And I just thought basically at this point it was never gonna come. So anyway, I'm in the bathroom. I um, did what I had to do. Put it right there on the toilet. And then, like, I was like, on the toilet seat like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. And I waited a lot of time. I never, mind you, I never waited a lot of time. I usually like peek really quickly. Anyway, I waited a lot of time. And then I like kind of like looked. And it said pregnant. And I was like, what? So I kind of like, did a double take and then I was like so initially I was just shocked like I was just shocked it wasn't even like excited or like sad I was just shocked I was like there's no way that this actually says pregnant so I picked it up looked to the light and I was like okay and then now I was thinking how am I gonna tell Taz like how am I gonna reveal this to him but then obviously after right after I was like super excited so yeah that's how I find I found out that I was pregnant okay cool cool so that's when you found out okay cool so how, I mean, how did you tell me? Like, what did, how did you think about that part? How you gonna tell me? So, I, like I said, I was excited. You gotta so, tell me about everything though. Mind you, Not we, everything, everything, but everything. Oh, so everything, everything, everything. Like, we was like, I was mad at you, you yeah, was mad at okay, me. Yeah, okay, so we were like, into it. <laughs> Look, he's annoying. So, we was into it at the time, and, Somebody's people are talking. So I'm mind you, I'm so excited. I'm like, whatever, I'm gonna have a baby, whatever. But I'm thinking like, how do I take him outside the house and actually tell him a big reveal and instead of just saying it in the house? I didn't want like obviously I already knew he was gonna be happy, but I didn't know how to tell him the best way basically. I didn't know how we were gonna get him out of the house. Like I said, we weren't we weren't on good terms, so how am I gonna get this guy out of the house if we're not on good terms? And I could tell him and then he'll be happy, but it'll kinda ruin it, you know, this happens once in a lifetime. <laughs> so hello, fast forward. I go outside. And I call Nico. And I'm like, girl. Who was Anika? One of my best friends, one of my really, really close friends. So I go outside and I call her and I'm just like, I mean she really has kids, so I'm like, um, girl. I'm pregnant. And then she's like starts screaming and she's driving. She's like, ah! And I'm like, yeah, girl. So we like kind of rejoice. I was like, well, I think I am. You know, I took a test. I said pregnant. So like, I guess so. And then I was like, but I'm not a tough test. Like, what, do, what should I do? So then we kind of like shot, shot ideas back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. 
and then we finally thought like um you know the idea of putting confetti into a box and then putting the pregnancy test in there was a good idea uh, so i was yeah, gonna get the card and she was like yeah you can get the card like that sounds super cute and i was like you sure and she was like yeah so i was like okay so i have a phone with her i went to walmart real quick and then you know i got everything together and then um i came back and i was like damn how am i gonna get him out the house so <clears throat> i was like hey um i gotta tell you something like, I gotta say something. And look, me, I was like, nah, I'm not having it. I was trying to be in my stubborn mode. I was like, nah, we ain't got nothing to talk about. I'm steady going out. Basically, and I'm like, thinking myself, like, first of all, we got nothing to talk about. First of all, you should have known something was up because I don't kiss your butt. So we would have been mad at each other for the end, for the end of time for the rest of the life. Because I wasn't going to talk to him. So anyway. So, yeah. anyway. so anyway, basically, I was like, nah. I am not going outside and then I'm like first off she was in like a she was like in a <laughs> what can I say how can I use it for a better word um better choice of word she was in she had an attitude like she was like emotional so I was like why would I go outside with you like this and like we said in the beginning it was a moment where we weren't talking to each other right so I was like, no, I'm not going outside. You're not getting me outside the house. I'm good, I'm watching TV, I'm good on the Netflix, you know? So. My dude, this was your off day. I came and I was early. off, I was <laughs> off. I'm like, hell no, I'm finna chill. I'm finna chill in the house. I'm not going outside, right? Yeah. I was not going outside. So. Yeah. Go ahead, go ahead. Tell, tell. So, fast so, what happened? What was I saying? I'm like, how can I get this? So then I started crying. Through the most. We I just wanted to blur it out there. And I was like, but if I don't blur it out, I would've been so mad at him. Like, I would have cursed him out. Like, you know, you ruined this for me. You ruined this for me. So I was like, no, contain it, girl. Hold it together. Hold it together. So I held it together. And I was like, think on your feet, think fast. So I was like, look, I settled a case. Like, we said I settled a case at work. And, like, I gotta tell you something. So he's already thinking, me. She got me a gift. Selfish over here. She got me a gift. She got me a Rolex. That's what it's in his mind right now. Oh, she said it was this huge case, blah, blah. Whatever, so. I was like, I think she closed. Oh, I almost said the word. <laughs> so anyway. <laughs> I thought she closed yeah, the big case, he, though. He thought that, um, you know, the firm that I work for, the lawyer, closed the case. And, like, we got a big, huge bonus or whatever. So. Needless to say, that was not the case, but he didn't know. I still was acting stubborn, though. I was like, <laughs> so, hell no, I'm not going. Yeah, no. but eventually I got out of the house. So anyway, so we were supposed to go originally go to Perry's, but Perry's ended up being closed. So I was like, think fast, think fast. So I went to a cross the street to this Mexican restaurant. I don't remember the name. And um, so I went there, and I, as soon as I got there, he, you know, he sat down. And I told the waiter, I said, get a cake. And, you know, I gave him all the instructions of what I want the cake to say. And then I already had the box with the confetti and stuff in it. So, yeah, I'll see you And then, like, I'm trying to stall. Because, oh, how I got out the house, I told him, I was like, all right, I'm going to just tell you, I'm going to just tell you in the car. Because he didn't even want to go out eat with me. He didn't want to do anything. He was doing the most. So I'm just like, at this point, I'm just like, bro, I don't, like, you making this about yourself. And this is not even about you right now. So, yeah, we started out all about so eventually I'm just like I give him the box and I know he thinks it's a roly. He kind of smirking at this point. I thought it was a roly. Now you can tell from this point what happened. Bust down roly. So yeah. So we get to the Mexican restaurant, right? She's like, oh, I gotta use the bathroom. Okay, cool. She gotta use the bathroom. She actually sneaks away and tells the waiter to write the uh, congratulations dad on the plate, right? With the cake. And I was like, I, well, I didn't, obviously I didn't notice at that point. I was just like, okay, she went to the bathroom. Still in my mold, still in my stubborn mold. Um, she comes back and she's like, um, but whole time she's like, I'm like, all right, tell me what's going on. What happened? Get to it like that, <laughs> like get to it. So um, she starts telling me and she's like, um, I said, well, no, no, no. I asked, could I open my box? You know? Yeah. 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 I asked, could no. I open? First of all, we're not on good terms. So why are you so anxious? Okay, not on the box. <laughs> so I open the box. I'm like, no, Rolly. No, I'm like, I'm like, dang. I'm the most unemotional person you can meet in your life when I open this box, and I'm just like, wow. 
what I said, what I said, like pro, like exact word. No, I said, I said, dang. But it, honestly, that was like the best way I personally could have found out, found out my wife was pregnant. Like we've been trying for years on years. But I opened the card, I opened up the uh, pregnancy test. It says pregnant, I said, no, you're lying. No, that's what I said. I said, no, nah, you're lying. I said, no, nah, you're lying. Great reaction. Yeah. Open the, open the card up, it says congrats. You're gonna be a dad. Okay, so now, what we're gonna talk about is our thoughts on what it's going to be. This is what I think it's going to be. Sorry, we have to cut that part short because um the camera's dying, so we're gonna like have to speed it up, sorry. But yeah, so he thinks it's gonna be a boy, but he's just saying girl so that it can magically be a boy. Uh, boy. And I think it's gonna be a girl, but it's probably gonna be a boy. So this is what I want it to be. This is what I think is going to be. I personally don't care what it is. What do you think it's gonna be though? I think it's gonna be a girl. But yeah, she's gonna be she team but girl. Boy, all the way. I'm not team she's girl. Team girl all the way. Alright, we got her What's gonna do? Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, it's up on, huh? Mm. 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 Mm.